Hey everyone and welcome back to Haste Kitchen. Following on from the spaghetti, which went down really well with you guys, I've created this really simple, like a smoky chorizo spaghetti. So this recipe is literally about 10 to 15 minutes, about the same sort of amount of time to get your water up to boil and to cook your spaghetti. So first of all, we're gonna get a pan and fill it with boiling water. And over here, our second pan, so our main pan, we're gonna get up to heat. Now I know loads of you have comments recently about how many times I say up to heat. Um, and I should probably elaborate on that a little bit. It basically means getting your pan as hot as you can as quickly as possible. Symbols. Right, into that we're gonna add one onion. Just gonna chop that in half, take off your ends. And my cameraman loves this piece because you never get a nice peel of an onion, ever. And we're going to just literally roughly chop that. And the same again with the other half. Nice little slices. Right, main pan. Little dash of olive oil. Just a little bit of oil. chorizo has got a high fat and a high oil element as well. So just a little dash in there because the oils themselves will come out of the chorizo sausage. Into that, a good handful of chorizo. I just really finely chopped that up. So chorizo's got a really nice element of smoky flavor in there. So that smokiness is gonna go into the onions. It will release some of that fat and they've got a beautiful orange color. Over here, we've got one clove of garlic. And you're gonna really roughly chop that up. And that can go straight into your pan. And you can see there, Within like a couple of minutes, you've got that beautiful sort of orangey color there to the onions. Right, our water's bubbling away. We're gonna get a decent handful. I've got some whole wheat spaghetti here. I'm gonna twist that round. Now, we have got some little baby cherry tomatoes here. Just literally chop them in half, add them to the sauce themselves. This sort of recipe is the simplest form of cooking and it is the perfect sort of thing to do when you get home from work. You just wanna do like 15 to 20 minutes it's done, it's on the table, it's relatively healthy. Another good shake of that pan. Right, we've got some citrus going in there. We're using the heart for a lemon. And then following on with the tomatoes, I'm gonna to use about five or six sun blush cherry tomatoes. Literally just finely chop them up into little slithers. And add that. Now they're quite oily themselves, so that's really what's gonna make your beautiful sauce. Over here, I've got 10 to 15 black and green olives. Now, a little splash from your pasta sauce, so some of your water, just a little splash, and that's gonna create the most beautiful, rich sauce. That's bubbling away. This is the perfect sort of dish when you get home from work, and you just wanna do quick, simple, healthy, easy recipes. 15 to 20 minutes, you've got the perfect dish on the table. Um, you also might have checked out my other recipe, which I've done a really simple lemon spaghetti on here. Go and check that one out as well. Lightly season, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Now those tomatoes are starting to break down nicely. Another little splash of our water. Look at the colors on that. Proper, vibrant, fresh and healthy. Our pasta is pretty much done. We're just gonna literally just add that straight into our sauce. Good mix round. And then finally, a good couple of handfuls of washed spinach. And just gonna let the residual heat of that pan itself just slightly wilt that through. And you can see there, within a couple of minutes, that is just wilted through perfectly. Ready to serve this one up. Good generous portion into the center of a nice bowl. And then lastly, a little bit of Parmesan just over the top. Now, if you wanna make this vegetarian, really simple. Take out the chorizo and just replace that with a teaspoon of smoked paprika and you'll get exactly the same sort of flavour, just not the meaty texture. It's just simple. Simple cooking, packed full of lovely light flavours. There you go, that is my simple 
tomato, sun blush tomato, really rich sauce with a beautiful cerrito, smoky sort of glaze to it. If you do get recreating this one, hashtag Miss Hayes Kitchen as always, please click subscribe. Click that little button down below, please, and I'll see you next week. Cheers then, bye-bye.